Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we are going to multiply these two given matrices with different dimensions. So the blue matrix on the left hand side has two rows and three columns. No wonder we call it two by three. And the right hand side red matrix has three rows and two columns. In order to get a full understanding of this topic, please watch this video till the very end for additional practice problems. So let's get started. Before we multiply these matrices, we are going to check matrix multiplication compatibility. In other words, can we multiply these two given matrices? In order to find out whether we can multiply these matrices, we can uh, look at the interior numbers, the inside numbers, the one that I circled them. Just check these numbers. Are these numbers same? Yes, these numbers are same. That means, yes, we can multiply these two given matrices. Had these numbers been different, then it's impossible. And finally, we are going to find out how our answer matrix is going to look like. What is going to be the dimension of our resultant matrix? To check that one, focus on these outside the exterior numbers. Just pair them up. So this is going to give us two by two. That means our answer matrix is going to have two rows and two columns. And here is the roadmap for our answer matrix. And that has two rows and two columns as you can see. Let's now start filling in these slots over here. Let's focus on the blue matrix on the left hand side. Look at this column, three, negative one. These numbers gonna go in this slot. The next column, negative four, zero is gonna go in this slot. And finally, this column is gonna go in this slot. Let's start filling out those ones. So that's gonna be three, negative one, negative four, zero, negative nine, eight. And likewise, we're gonna fill out these blue numbers in the second column as well. And here is the matrix that has all these blue numbers nicely spread out. Now let's focus on our right hand side red matrix. You look at this negative two, five, four. This column, we're gonna make it a convert into a row. So that's going to become negative two, five, four. And in the next column, seven, negative six, zero, that is going to become row as well. So seven is going to go over here, negative six and zero. In our next step, we are going to make sure that this negative two gets filtered in in this slot five goes over here, four goes over here, and likewise. So that means this number negative two is gonna go over here, negative two over here as well, five here, five over here as well, four and four. Likewise, this seven gets in over here, negative six goes over here, and zero goes over here. And here is our final product with all these blue and red numbers nicely spread out. Now in the next step, we are going to multiply these parentheses. Three times negative two is going to become negative six. Negative four times five becomes negative 20. Negative nine times four is gonna become negative 36. Likewise, we're gonna multiply out all these parentheses. And here I put down this negative 6, negative 20, negative 36 in single parentheses, as you can see for all these multiplications. And here is our next matrix without parentheses. I simplified that one out over here. And the next final step is going to be, I am going to simplify it furthermore over here. Negative six, negative 20, negative 36 
if we simplify that one that is going to give us negative 62 that is going to give us 45 this is going to give us 34 and finally this is going to give us negative 7 and that is our answer matrix so thus our answer matrix turned out to be this one with two rows and two column and that is our answer and here is your assignment can you do this problem on your own now you can take your time you can pause the video luckily i have already uploaded this video as well please go ahead and check it out and see the correct answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye